Hey Retro Gamers, my apologies for the delays, but I got a replacement Saturn and was able to record the footage to do this review on Christmas Nights into Dreams. But after I recorded it, I had over an hour's worth of material to edit down, which is why it took so long. Okay, Christmas Nights into Dreams was a sampler or demo disc released during the 1996 Christmas season and was used to promote Nights into Dreams, possibly the greatest title the Sega Saturn ever produced. The demo was included on the PS2 version of Nights in the Dreams, but is missing a lot of bonus content. Despite it being a demo disc, this is considered its own standalone game. The main theme takes place around Christmas time, and you play as Elliot and Clarice, who take control of Nights, and during the time between November and February, you play the first level of the game, but in a snowy Christmas theme. The level looks amazing! Full of snow and Christmas ornaments and some really good Christmas music that will give you holiday cheer. Knights is dressed in a Santa outfit, and if you set your Saturn's eternal clock to December 25th, you will see Santa Claus on his sleigh from time to time. The boss even has a Christmas suit, which adds even more holiday creation to the game. In November and late January and February, the level changes and you see snow, but less Christmas themed. If you play the game or set your clock to January 1st, you'll get a new title screen saying Happy New Year's and you play as normal nights, but in a snowy Christmas stage. The game even has a Valentine's Day theme, and you need to set your clock to February 14th, but also set your time to 12 a.m. or 0000, and you'll have a snowy stage, but instead of snow, you'll have hearts raining down. If you play the game on April 1st, or set your clock to April 1st, you get to play as Ralia, who is Knight's enemy. I forgot to mention, as you play it in different months and themes, the songs will change. If you play the game at any point of the year other than winter time, the game becomes Knights Limited Edition and is basically the first level of Knights into Dreams. There is also a memory game where you need to match the images to unlock extras such as bonus stages, including one where you can try and set the best times per lap of the course as well, different music tracks and so forth. The game is full of variety which makes it such an anomaly because this is a demo disc. And Senka made very little off it because most of the time it was given away or was made available for limited sale or for rent only. The fact that this much was put into a demo really shows how much Sega put into Nights Into Dreams. I ended up making an unintentional sequel in this game. I did not forget, but decided to save the best for last. Yes, you can unlock and get to play the stage as Sonic the Hedgehog. We Sonic fans were robbed of a 32-bit Sonic title and this gives us a taste of what we never got and you explore the level on foot and jump up to collect blue orbs and defeat the bosses then you go to the boss stage and bounce around and bite a bouncy version of Dr. Eggman around until you defeat him and this is a very special present to have ultimately guys this is a very enjoyable title but yes it is not cheap because a lot of copies were tossed aside back in the day and are no longer around and I managed to get a North American copy for around 30 bucks and yes, I know, some of you see the game as just one level and one boss, but it is far more with the changes in the levels from time of the year and special presents, and for Sonic fans getting the only chance to use Sonic the Hedgehog in combat on the Sega Saturn, which is a major incentive in itself. I encourage you guys to check out this rare piece of history and get to see one of the only christmas theme based games ever created. I'm going to close this episode by having game footage of the game playing for the last few minutes. I hope you guys enjoyed my review of Nights Into Dreams Christmas. See you guys later, this is the Entertainment Wizard, signing off.
of nights, Elliot and Clarice found the star, shining in seven colors, but the entire story was a dream. So what was that star? They don't talk about the dream they saw, but there is one thing both of them know. Something special will happen after they embark on an adventure with knights. They start feeling cheerful again. like the light of a small candle, starts filling the city once again. Everything is okay now. Give a star of happiness to the heart of these brave children. Give a star of happiness to the heart of everyone. Merry Christmas. <laughs> 